Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be reviewing for you the um, latest mascara from Max Factor which looks like this and it's called False, La False, False Lash Effect Mascara Fusion Volume and Length. Um, according to Max Factor it will give you, and according to this, the False Lash Effect. Um, okay, obviously it is not going to give you a false eyelash effect at all. What it will give you is a very decent, very solid mascara. Now this here in the UK cost me $11.99, which I think is really, really expensive for a basically a drugstore brand. So I think that, that the price is really high. Now let me show you the applicator and you can have a look and see what you think. The applicator looks like this and it's a plastic wand. And a lot of companies are now using plastic wands because they do, I think that they're actually better than the kind of standard ones. but. This will work on your lashes, providing you have um, medium to long lashes. If you've got really, really short lashes, this is not the mascara for you because the wand's too big and it's going to get messy. Um, generally speaking, I've done a demo, you'll see it in a second, so you can actually see what it looks like on the eyes. One to two coats looks fine, three starts to look a mess, so you need to bear that in mind. This isn't waterproof and it absolutely can run, so you also need to bear that in mind as well. But it is still a good mascara, providing you know, you've know you got long lashes to begin with, or relatively long lashes, and it does certainly add length and a little bit of thickness, so that's really, really nice. The wand also probably does most of that, I would think. But in general, I think it's a good mascara. I think it's very overpriced for what it is, and um, but I think a lot of people will like it. So um, have a look at the demo, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Okay, so this is application one, and I think that this is probably my favorite. It's a light coating and just looks good. You notice in my eyes, while I've got one of those weird kind of color spots. So this comes application two, and again, this is a good application. I think if we separated the lashes a little bit with a lash separator, it would have been fine. And here comes a third application, and I think that this is overdone. Other than the fact that I've got it on my eyelid, I just think they're too clumpy and even separating them they wouldn't look that great so thanks for watching and i'll see you next time bye bye